So here we have an HDR scene, high dynamic range image-based lighting being used. And when we want to add shadows, what we can do is add a directional light. There's our sky. But we can add a directional light that appears to originate, see the basic angle, from where the light in the image originates. So now, when we go to the sky object and we rotate it, notice the shadows there. They're subtle because of the nature of the level, but we've got shadows that seem to be lined up with the image-based lighting. So for instance, we could script the rotation of this cube, or of this, not the cube, of the sphere, to create a sun that raises and falls. Let's see what happens when we hit. <laughs>